Now the latest in the avian flu story. More than 94,000 fowl were slaughtered last night at a Taipei wholesale poultry market after Council of Agriculture Minister Lin Tongshen announced a national week-long ban on the transportation of poultry. Authorities took pains to disinfect the slaughterhouse facilities in which the mass cull took place. But Lin's announcement of the cull seemingly caught markets and poultry farmers off guard. Epidemic prevention experts held disinfectant sprays as they sanitised this slaughterhouse at a Taipei market. After this, it will be closed for seven days to prevent a potential bird flu epidemic. In response to a week-long ban from the Council of Agriculture on the transportation of poultry, slaughterhouse employees have been up all night, killing all their livestock. The Taipei City Animal Protection Office also sent officials to monitor the cull all night to ensure not a single chicken was overlooked. Each fowl must undergo a pre-mortem inspection by specialised veterinarians and if any abnormalities are discovered they must notify our epidemic prevention unit and we will handle the matter immediately on the spot. However, the public is questioning why the Council of Agriculture has not imposed these measures on poultry raised indoors. They wonder if this means the ban on transport of fowl only amounts to a half-hearted attempt. We are not taking this lightly. We are not the way we were two years ago, completely inexperienced and in a rush. And so during this period, we hope that agricultural authorities from local governments everywhere will work to guide the entire industry. The council says chickens raised indoors are in a much more sanitary environment and the risk of infection is low. Even though there is a seven-day ban on the transportation of poultry, there will still be a supply of chicken meat. There are also worries that dishonest farmers might slaughter their own fowl and sell their meat illegally. The COA has warned that the maximum penalty for this is a fine of 100,000 New Taiwan dollars.